But let's go to the library. There will be times when you have to pick. The library is distinctly forlorn without the presence of the distinctly ditzy Maggie, another victim of the cold hearted doctor. As the librarian virtually lived here, it's more than likely that this is the place wherein you will find more information on her liaisons with her lethal lover. Where to start looking, though? Let's start then. Book of Revelations. One of the library shelves looks strange to you, and it appears that it is trying to tell you something. Can oh you no, not re these again. Get ready, set, go, go, go. Oh wait, I was supposed to... T? Who is guilty? Let's see. No sense to have. Sorry, but I just I've no idea. And your result is exactly wrong. I'm just going to give up again. This isn't Come really going well now. this time. One more try. But well, it's the You're final. You're giving up? Well, probably for the best. Here's how I would have done it. Oh come on! How are you supposed to get that? This game. You uncover the librarian's diary. It's so much a product of its owner that it's too easy to imagine the lady who created the sugary prose. He took me on another walk today. We passed the watermill and paused. I stood guard and he went in to have a closer look. I suppose he wondered if it were suitable for a more intimate assignation. <laughs> so romantic. I do love him so. Another entry piques your interest. So handsome, my Heathcliff of the Health Center. He came to me one scented eve, dressed head to toe in flower. He'd gone to the assistance of the hard-pressed miller, helping him to deliver flour to the overworked baker at great cost to himself, was a kind, selfless man. So, 
Now you know to investigate the water mill, wind mill, and the bakery. It's time to leave this place to its tragic ghosts. All right. Let's go to the doctor's house then and see what we can do there. Once again, you find yourself in the untidy living quarters of the deadly doctor. Watson is on high alert as you carefully search the house, and you are listening as much as looking in case the fugitive returns. You steal yourself, looking around for a weapon. None are to be found. Abruptly, a door opens. Hey, now. What a shock. First woke me up and no mistake. Calming down, you ask the constable what he's doing. I was relieved at the manor, so I thought I'd come down here and help search a few places. Don't think I can sleep much knowing he's out there. I found the car that, well, that ran Maggie down. It's out the back. <laughs> We'd better keep looking. He's right. You return to your search. Paper trail. Amongst the untidiness and dirt, you find a stack of papers that may help you with your investigations. Can you decipher the doctor's notes? Get ready, set, go, go, go. Oh my. I guess we need to start at something, so... Rain there actually is. So, oh, wait. Ah, oh, so. That one has to be a territory. Really, but no, it has to go like that. I still like the rain. Eh, why not? Eeny, meeny, miny. Oh, please. Oh, my God. I think I'm going to You're give up on this one, too. This beat you. You're giving up. This ain't well, going well. Probably for the best. Two of five. Were you paying any attention? Watch me. Mm. Oh well. You do seem to have found something of interest. But it's not something easily understood. Oh, it's all in some kind of code. Can you crack it? You assure the constable that you can and encourage him to head back to the police station to try to get some sleep. Reluctantly, he complies. You have the doctor's notebook back at your hotel. 
Perhaps something in that can help decipher this new evidence. Let's go to the hotel then. The hotel is suspiciously quiet, with no manager in sight to harass you on your way back to your room. You spend some time poring over the doctor's notebook and the papers you found on the second visit to his house. Abruptly, Watson jumps up, sniffing the pages you're about ready to consign to the dustbin. With that, your canine colleague is away, only to return minutes later with a lemon clutched in his jaws. He's followed by a disgruntled chef. Hey, 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 where do you go, you damn mutt? Oh, oh, well, how do you like that? <laughs> it's yours. I should have guessed. <laughs> how do you like that? I slip all the way up here after that crazy mutt, and it's yours. <laughs> so tell me, how am I going to finish my recipe now? He took the lemon. How do you like that? I don't even know if I got enough now. What you going to do, huh? What you going to do? Watson's pilfering may help you out, so it seems only fair you should assist the chef with his problem. Well, I guess we need to help him then. The bitter end. <laughs> <laughs>